In this lesson, we're going to cover what I like to call the newbies or maybe the novice users or maybe the I want to play with the big boys, but I don't want to use the big boys toys or big girls, if you will. So what is this? It's code deployment with BeanstalkApp.com. Deploy your code and never open a terminal. What does it mean to deploy your code? I looked up deploy and I was going to put a fantastic definition of it right here, but instead I made one up. Move your code from environments such as local to production. Well, I do this already. I open up my FTP program, I drag the folder that has my website that I've been working on locally, and I drag it to my server, and it uploads, and there you go. I deployed my site. Well, sure, you deployed your site, but what you didn't do was your, your site was not in version control. Version control is a must. It's not just for developers. Again, it's not just for developers. I can easily say that because I am not a developer. But what I do do is I work on websites and I do a lot of stuff and I do it in version control. Why do I do that? Well, I was told to and because I wanted to learn how to do it and I found out why it's a good idea to put stuff into version control. Why is it? Well, first of all, this gives you a backup of everything that you're working on. You can now be part of the team. Teams work in version control systems and everybody's working on different things and those things come together and they're brought together and the version control system handles all of this and that's why version control is helpful. Also, you can fix your mistakes. So if you realize down the line that yesterday that was working, today it's not, what can I do? Well, version control can allow you to roll back to yesterday if you want. Also, version control is just a good idea. Git. Git is a type of version control. It's a type of version control we're going to be discussing in this lesson. It's also the type of version control that uh, Drupal uses, hence the reason why we're talking about it. Git. You don't have to be a rocket scientist to use it. Although being a rocket scientist might help you use Terminal and do some crazy stuff and put some cool commands in there that run all these things that are going on inside of Git. But guess what? You don't need to do that to be able to take advantage of Git and version control. Also, there's a GUI for that. Sure. Git does have many, many, many GUIs out there for Windows or for Mac. In this lesson, we're going to be using Tower, a Git GUI on the Mac operating system. And like I said, Git, it's what Drupal uses. It's what the contributor modules use, and it's what Core uses. Finally, like I mentioned, it's excellent for collaboration, and Git makes bringing people's codes and figuring out conflicts together a lot easier. Deployment. Never manually FTP or SFTP your site again. It's fantastic. You'll never have to do that again. You only update what needs updating. It's not a matter of what we used to do, which is just probably grabbing all the files to our site and uploading them in, or maybe even just like a folder of files. You can work locally, and then what you'll do is you'll use deployment, and that will basically take what you've done and get it to your production server. And finally, we're going to be working with the beanstalkapp.com. This makes this all super easy with no terminal required. We're going to show you how you can have a repository, make some changes locally, commit those into the repository, merge that into your, your master branch, and then what we're going to do is we're going to have that deployed to your production server. And you can do all of this, all of this with just a GUI and a web interface.